Look at this beautiful place being destroyed. X marks the spot. Oh, and I know, I know, this is all uh, natural contrails. Yeah, planes generally fly crisscrossed over the mountain. I don't know if they're trying to deforest us here in the Mount Washington Valley or what, folks. But, uh, and I just saw the camera getting real blurry. I need better equipment. That, that'll be uh, the troll's way out of this one. Oh, you had bad equipment. Those are natural clouds. That's, that's normal air traffic, normal contrails. You see, it's so cold, even though it's about 80 degrees out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, everything is fine. Nothing to see here. Bullshit. By the way, folks, that's uh, Mount Washington uh, in New Hampshire. So much love, many thanks, and uh, you know, maybe uh, it's time to start worrying about uh, what we eat, you think? What we drink. Might be time to start asking some politicians some questions and proving what's in the planes and proving where the air traffic flows. We could spend tons of time and research, I guess. Maybe we'll have to. Much love, many thanks, and I'll see you soon. 1238. I know, Kevin, what the hell does that mean? And why is it relative to anything? Well, an hour and four minutes has passed since I showed you that they're chemtrailing the piss out of uh, the mountains here in the Mount Washington Valley. And if you can see off in the distance, there's another X further down. You can see the one has spread. And this trail that was just a thin trail has developed into a full set of clouds. Well, I guess clouds, if that's what you want to call it. And I know, I know, this is normal. Can you see it? They sprayed a set of X's and now they're going deeper into the mountains. I was contacted by an anonymous advocate against this who has noted in southern New Hampshire constant spraying over the national forest by unmarked planes. Their thesis is they're trying to deforest the national forest. I, I don't know about that. But there has to be a reason. Maybe there's a virus in the wild that we don't know about yet. Maybe they're trying to put a virus in the wild because they know pretty soon we're gonna have to live off the land. And they don't want you to be able to. They want you to be subservient and reliant on all those FEMA camps they spent all that money on. But anyway, I do know that rather that was a regular plane trail, which it was not, but even if I submit to that, I know that I don't like it. I know that I'm not gonna tolerate it, and I know that it's part of the reason that everybody's losing their fucking minds. We're absorbing so many different chemicals into our bodies that should have never been created in the first place. We can't fathom its effects on humanity. This has to stop and you have to stand up and make your politicians come clean. For any of you that are just new to chemtrails or still wanting to rebut the fact, go to weathermodificationincorporated.com. Look at their global list of partners. Look under the United States and see that the top customer for Weather Modification Inc. from the United States is the Department of Defense. You're not fucking defending me here. You're killing me and killing you. Stop the bullshit, get active, make people answer questions. I want documents, I want chemicals. I want times, I want dates, I want styles of planes. I want all the information. Is it for weather modification or is it like in the case of New York where they do spray for viruses? 
West Nile and other things. Anyway, that's the progression. In one hour, we got a nice set of clouds heading over the mountains, and they're not satisfied because off in the distance, they're spraying more. Much love, many thanks, and uh, if they don't kill us, I'll see you soon. And you've got to put your bodies upon the gears and upon the wheels, upon the levers.